Now, let's go to the Mountain Laurel Festival in Pineville for guest weather. Presented by Crete Chevrolet, Middlesboro Mall, Bell County Tourism, and the Kentucky Mountain Laurel Festival. Welcome to beautiful Pineville, Kentucky today for the Kentucky Mountain Laurel Festival. It's beautiful. You guys got to come down here and get some of the lemonade. It's awesome. Strawberry lemonade is the best. Yes. I'm here all the way from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, enjoying the Kentucky Mount Laurel Festival. Got these nice gentlemen at WYMT helping me along with this. Sunny weather, nice, good food, good friends. Come on downtown, Pineville. Come on down to the Mount Laurel Festival. It's a pretty day. Back to you, man. <laughs> Well, it looks like everyone was having a great time out there at the Mount Laurel Festival today, Brandon. I know yeah, plenty was. of sunshine and pretty warm out there, too. Yeah, good weather for it. I know mm -hmm. a lot of folks have said on Thursday it was a little bit dreary, had the clouds around, it was a little chilly, but yeah. certainly not this weekend. Fairly nice. But we've been getting some photos in, not only of the festival, you can see some of those on our Facebook page, but check this one out. How would you like to see this, waking up and looking out your window to see a bear staring back at you? This one was sent in. From Caney Cornet, this is over towards Whitesburg, Kentucky and Letcher County. A lot of bear sightings on Facebook too. You can join in on the conversation there, but otherwise no rain out there. You can see no rain in the background of the photo and no rain on Pinpoint Doppler. So that's some good news. That's how Pinpoint Doppler is going to stay for the remainder of the weekend, but then that will start to change. We'll start to see some storms pop up by the time we get towards Memorial Day. In fact, we're already seeing a few clouds start to stream in from the west. You can see over the past six hours, some of them have been pushing on through. They just haven't been producing any rainfall and they won't until Monday. It's so dry out there during the day today. So even though temperatures were near 80 degrees, it wasn't that humid out, so it didn't feel too bad. But still a little bit on the warm side, 63 over towards Paintsville, 67 still over towards Jackson. That's the warm spot, but we're already into the 50s as far as the valleys go, like out towards Monticello. That's over towards Wayne County over 59 degrees right now. It's warm all across the eastern United States, especially the southeast. They're still into the 70s, 78 down towards Mississippi. Storms off towards the west. That's where a cold front is located. And you can see how slow moving they are. There's flood emergencies in some of the towns down there. Major flooding going on, even some tornadoes, severe weather. All of that is staying off towards our west for the next couple of days. And we don't have big chances of severe weather, at least over the next week. So that's some good news. But we surely will see the thunderstorms, and you'll see those on future view as we get towards Memorial Day. So overnight tonight, temperatures dip down into the middle 50s. Not feeling too bad. The humidity is not too bad. But as we go throughout the day on Sunday, you'll notice an increase in humidity compared to Sunday morning compared to the evening hours. It will be filtering in from the south throughout the day. And you can see the temperatures boost on up once again. A little bit warmer than it was today. We'll likely make it into the low to mid 80s by tomorrow afternoon. The air goes on Monday. Monday afternoon, those pop up showers and thunderstorms. You can some, see some red there in future view, a little bit heavier rain in some of those as they push on through. So there's a stormy weather pattern. You can see it drops our temperature only by a few degrees, but either way you look at it, still above average. Middle 70s is where we typically are for this time of year. And much of next week will be covered up with temperatures into the low 80s for the most part. So feeling pretty warm for a good chunk of next week, but you can see the storms that's weather pattern. That stormy weather pattern that we're getting into is going to continue at least up until next weekend. All right, so get out there once again. Enjoy that warm weather, the sunshine yeah. while we've got it because the rain's coming. That's right. It's, it's going to be dry tomorrow, but even in between, you'll get some dry days. Uh, it's going to be hit and miss showers and right. thunderstorms next All week. Right.